Welcome to Jones News, your news provider. Politicians never killed in Sligoville. Please remember to share, like, subscribe, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily uploads. Hi guys, welcome back. It's a girl MJ. Now before we go into the major story, I hope on an arty. I hope everybody doing all right. El Shaman reported missing. Romario Ferguson, 25 year old, a factory worker of Blackbeard Circle, Helsha Heights in St. Catherine, has been missing since Saturday, May 8. According to the Helsha police, Ferguson was the last seen about 12.30 p.m. after he left home to visit a female companion and has not been heard from since then. I'm only hoping that he did not go to meet one of those online girls, those girls who are meeting men on dating sites. His mode of dress at the time he went missing is unknown. The Elsha police is asking anyone who have seen or know where Romario Ferguson is to contact them at 876-424-6758. The police 119 emergency number or the nearest police station. We know a lot of times all these stories always end. But I'm keeping my fingers crossed and praying for the family that they'll get some good news about this gentleman very soon. Now about a day or two ago, I had posted three pictures of three men that were wanted by the police. And I can now inform you that one of the men has turned himself in, Maurice Hussein Campbell, who was featured as wanted by the police. Because the JCF now is now posting a wanted Wednesdays where they post photos of men that are wanted. And the police are now happy to say that he has turned himself in, accompanied by his attorney on Thursday. So it was reported wanted on wednesday and of course him catching fred because them no one dead him turning himself thursday so he was wanted by a lawman in the st andrew south division in connection with a murder on january 24 2021 and i can happily report that he has no campbell has now turned himself in and finally politicians never killed in Sligoville. the police has confirmed the gun murder of a man with some listed st catherine he has been identified as Rajiv Nesbeth of Heathfield, Linstead. He was shot and killed at Bamboo Way in Sligoville, St. Catherine on Monday night. So about 10.50 p.m., residents heard loud explosions and alerted the police. On the arrival, Nesbeth was found lying on the roadway beside a motor car with gunshot wounds. He was taken to hospital where he was pronounced dead. CMO, CMO. Police, um, citizens, residents here, explosion, call the police, then find people with gunshot, them dead. Nesbeth is the nephew of Dr. Sandra Nesbeth, a former general election candidate for the Jamaica Labour Party in St. Catherine Northwest. Relatives are saying that Nesbeth was a very friendly person in the street and everybody knows him. They're not, they're not aware of any reason as to why he was in Sligoville where the incident took place. What they know is that he usually have a girlfriend on that side of the, the parish. So he normally goes there. They said that he was in the company of friends. So there's a whole lot of unanswered questions in regards to Nesbeth. But one thing that we're sure of is that he received gunshot wounds. The police responded. He was taken to the hospital and he has been pronounced dead. So another sad day, a family in mourning for a loved one that has been taken out so that is all for today guys make sure so not take care of yourself and keep safe enough love respect and blessings jones news your news provider please remember to share like subscribe leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily uploads